But I just need it to stay fresh, you know? Hey guys, I'm Kaylee. Today I'm going to be doing my, my braces routine. So basically, I'm going to be showing you what I do. I bought some new things because all the things I was using are kind of getting like old and stuff. So I just bought new things. And we're just going to show you what I got. So I got everything from Walmart. Not sponsored. <laughs> but I'm going to show you everything first. Well, first, we need like the toothbrush, you know. But before we get on with everything, the show that it goes to. And don't forget to like me, subscribe, and also comment below. I don't think you can still comment below because YouTube regulations or whatever. So go to my Instagram, officially.kaylee, and go comment what other videos you guys want to see next and everything. So I'm going to start off with my toothbrush. Hold up. Okay, so I had this electric toothbrush. It is this Philips Sonic Air. But when I did it, it like vibrates a lot and my teeth are really sensitive and now I just got them tightened and like they really hurt. So this one was like too rough on my teeth so I like couldn't use it. So that's why I had to get a normal one. So I got just this normal toothbrush. But then I got another one and like the top is like bigger. And this is the spin brush from Arm & Hammer. And it's just this. And it just looks like it would like feel better because not that rough. Next, the toothpaste I use is the 3D Crest toothpaste. And then I also got these gum pro XI brush. I don't know how to say this. I'm sorry. But it's just these and I got this when I first got my braces in the braces kit they give you. And it helped a lot with all the plaque on your teeth and everything. So that is good. And then next I got just mouthwash. It is the 3D Crest White mouthwash. So that's basically everything I use. Also, I'm not going to be showing you in this. But you do also floss with them. You take... Actually, I'm going to show you, but I don't do it every single day, every single morning and night. It's so hard to do with braces. So I'm going to show you how to do that when I get to it. If not, you could always use a water flosser thingy. It's just this. But the plugs in this bathroom don't work, so I always use it in my other one, but this bathroom has a lot of space where I can film this so yeah let's get started all right guys so now I'm going to first show you how I floss well you floss with braces so you have these little thingies they're like a little hoop thing and I think you could get it like all these other places but I couldn't find them at Walmart but I got these from like the dentist itself so they look like this. And then you wanna just take any floss. You take a strand. And then, let's see if I can focus. Okay, you take a strand, put it through the hoop. Like, oops. Like, this is really hard, I'm sorry. Like that. Then you have to put it through the wire. Okay, so you go like this. Then you push it through. Okay. And then. Just floss and then you have to do that in every single one. Too much work, so that's all I'm going to show you. That's how you floss with braces. It's like way harder than regular, just going like that. Then hoop it through. That's why I recommend a water flosser. Helps a lot than doing this. But now I'm going to go on with the real routine. Alright guys, so I just took the toothbrush out and I just like tested it. 
and it is way softer than that one and it does not hurt my teeth at all so i re really recommend this one but i wet my toothbrush before i don't know about you guys i just do it because it's like dry and i just don't like it let me put it okay so i put water on top of it and then i put the toothpaste and then i put water again that's just how i do it i guess you could say I just put it on, let me put on more water. Okay, so when I use these type of toothbrushes, I like to go like blend it all in and then use the that. Cause I have to get the toothpaste actually on my teeth. Okay. And also when you are brushing your teeth, go circular motions, never go like that. It's not good. And then, so you go under, under, over, and then on. Sorry, that is disgusting. And then over, so yeah. And then you go on this side, this side, this side, this side, all that. so many cuts in my gums it hurts so bad okay so I could not put any more pressure on my teeth I have too much sensitive also a lot of mint hurts my gums and but I just need it to stay fresh you know it hurts so bad my gums are literally filled with holes everywhere it hurts so bad okay so let me clean the brush Okay, so that is why I got a normal brush so I could actually go in now without struggling and not hurting. So that's why I got a normal brush. Now I'm gonna do it. See, now this is easier. Also, I'm. this is nighttime right now, so my tongue is not like dirty with the white stuff, but in the morning you want to scrub your tongue until all the white stuff goes off, so all your breath smells good. Hey braces, I do not, oh my god. Anyway, so I am done. Just clean my teeth. Anyways, now I'm going to use the brushes just to make sure I'm clean. So they look like this. I'll have toothpaste all over my shirt, great. You wanna go all around like your brackets and everything. So yeah, just go throughout your racket. Yeah. And then also inside of the, to get all the plaque out. My teeth are extremely hurting, so that's why I'm not going really in depth like with the cleaning right now. Cause my teeth literally are hurting so bad. I cannot like put any pressure on them right now. Cannot do it. Hurts really bad. Anyways, now I'm gonna use my mouthwash and that would be the end of my routine. wash your mouth for like 60 seconds so we're gonna do that okay that was not 60 seconds but like I literally cannot it burns so bad cannot that tastes good Okay, but like there's cuts in my mouth and like mint really like hurts it. So let me go clean off and I'll see you guys later. All right, you guys, so now I'm gonna give you tips on things that you should know before you get braces and all that. So they say you cannot chew gum. Chewing gum is like the main part of me. I chew gum 24 seven. And also when you first get your braces, 
you will feel tightness and all that and gum actually helps while chewing it but if you listen to your doctors and all you I mean dentists people doctors yeah all that you should listen don't eat popcorn and all that um, I eat popcorn like 24 7 as well so like but yeah also when I first got my top braces it didn't really hurt it does not hurt at all when you get them on like when you're getting the process of getting them on but it does hurt afterwards when you wait a little while it's you could start feeling the movement bottom ones hurt a lot and also there's these little hooks right here they go into your gum and also make sure when you get them make sure no wires are poking you like me make sure it's because one bracket fell off and now there's long piece of wires Hang on, these, I don't know how they're poking me. They were not poking me there. Okay, other things, you should always get like dark colors for your like teeth. Black is my most suggested. People say, oh, don't get that, it makes your teeth look bad. Oh no, they make it look good. Better than light colors, like don't get yellow. It'll look like you have stains on your teeth. They say black makes you look like you have stains on your teeth. It really doesn't make your teeth look whiter, actually. Also, carry wax on you. Here, I'll show you. I have one. Always carry orthodontist, orthodontic wax on you. Because if a wire is poking you, you can put this on. Looks like this. And then you just, oops, you just roll it onto wherever you need it, basically. And it helps with like the hurting and stuff. But yeah, that is basically my tips for you. Also, if you're getting an expander, I had one before. And I did not know, like I, I got a McChicken, which is a sandwich at McDonald's, and I, tr I did it. It was not the best experience. Food got stuck. I did not know food gets stuck up there. And it was like, I couldn't like, I couldn't breathe because like, it was clogged up there. I don't know. Just be careful. Use your tongue as a suction cup to get the food out. I know that sounds really weird, but trust me. Also, Allison did not have it. Well, she had it, but she did not have it like when I got mine first. And like she was always like, ew, Kaylee, okay, stop doing that. When I had food stuck, I had to go to get it out. And then she was like, ew. And then when she got it, I was like, haha, Allison. And I got mine off. Like, yeah, you see, you see, you have to do it too. So anyways, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope this video was helpful in some way. I don't know. But yeah, also, a lot of people ask me when I'm getting my braces off, they lie. They always say, oh, you're getting it off next appointment? No, Kevin had his on for like six years. They said they were gonna take them off like two years ago, but nothing happened, so he still has them. All three, me, Kevin, and Kendry have full sets. Love that. And yeah, so thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed and don't mind the toothpaste on me. And see you guys in the next one.